I mean, what else can I really feel at the minute? I'm at home <laughs> majority of my time because my body is at the point in pregnancy now where it just wants to sleep and it just wants to nest and that's literally it. That's become my life basically. And it's so weird because so many people said to me, you get to a point in pregnancy where like the pregnancy tiredness hits you and the nesting mode really hits you and like loads of other things and I was kind of like oh, okay waiting for ages and I feel like for me it didn't happen for so long and then it was like one day it just switched and like it's just the craziest thing like the amount of <laughs> breaks I have to have like if I'm filming or if I'm doing any kind of task or anything like that yeah at the moment it's just a lot and I think the twins are getting, they're getting uncomfortable, I'm getting uncomfortable and I feel like it's just a lot for my body at the minute so I'm just trying to like take it slow, take it easy. Um, so this morning I really just fancied having a slow morning with me and Bradley so I made a coffee and then I was like you know what I really want to make some shortbread <laughs> because I love shortbread. So I made some shortbread, I forgot to film me pouring the chocolate on but it is in the fridge setting, so I'll cut it with you and we can pop it in the little cake stand. Um, I'll pop the Jane's Patisserie recipe that I use in the description box down below because it's honestly my favourite. All of her recipes are just so good. And like, if I want to know how to do anything, I just go to her website. But yeah, I wanted to have a cosy vlog with you. I've got some parcels, I think you can see one here, from Amazon, um, which is little bits and bobs, some bits for the twins, bits to decorate the house with a little bit more because I've been obsessed with like trends and stuff on TikTok. And I've been like, okay, I really want to try that. So I thought we could do a little bit more decorating. Um, and then I've just got some little stuff that I want to do with you guys at home. So I hope you're nice and cosy. I'm going to quickly curl my hair. We've actually got a meeting to go to um, in about an hour. So I need to curl my hair, kind of get ready, and then go to that meeting and then come home and just chill. <laughs> That's what I can't wait for. So to curl my hair, I'm going to use my Foxy Locks Gold Plated Titanium Curling Wand. This is all I use to curl my hair because it's the best, basically. And I'm really excited to say that they have partly sponsored this portion of today's video. You guys know I work with Foxy Locks every single month and there is a reason for it because their products are just 10 out of 10. So I've actually got their tape hair extensions in here which have grown out. Look how much they've grown out. Can you see that? So I'm getting these taken out this week and refitted. Yes, I'm having hair extensions for when I have my babies. I've just had so many people say it's actually easier than having your natural hair 
and I will take that because I love wearing them and I feel like if I like straighten or curl my hair whatever the extension hair just like holds anything in place so I'm really excited to get these refitted and just have a little bit of like a glam before having the babies so I use the shade brown black and they are such high quality these extensions last at least a year which is insane. I've never heard of anything like it. Obviously, using Foxy Looks products with them helps so much. So I use their shampoo and conditioner to wash my hair. That smells amazing. So that's got argan oil in it, and it's just the nicest, thickest shampoo and conditioner, and it just lasts so long, honestly. And it looks really nice in your bathroom. Um, and then I use this God Luxury Hair Oil. This has been my saving grace. And I said this to you guys before, but recently I've been watching loads of videos about like hair care and stuff like that. And I didn't realize how important it is to oil your hair, okay? I didn't realize like it is so important for like split ends, just to help your hair in general, like the health of your hair, the shine of your hair, the softness, everything. And this is amazing because this oil you can actually use as a heat protectant as well. So this is like the perfect oil ever. Um, so this has actually got keratin collagen in it and also it's infused with argan oil. This is the same scent as the shampoo conditioner, which is amazing. So when you use them together, it's like it refreshes your hair, it just smells incredible and then to finish off i mean this is nearly empty now i've actually got another one thank god and uh, this is the foxy Lux shine spray hair perfume smell i want this in perfume form like actual perfume because it smells incredible this is just amazing and again it literally does what it says it shines your hair right at the end it's like the finishing touch and it smells incredible so yeah this is a must have for me as well so i'm going to keep brushing my hair throughout with the paddle brush um, and a hack i have to keep your curls lasting longer is to use a fan like a handheld fan um, sometimes i rest the curl on my shoulder or something it just kind of depends but this is the quickest way and um, you kind of want the curl to cool down before you then drop it and that'll make it last longer so using a handheld fan when it's kind of in your hair will like speed that process up a little bit so yeah i'm gonna curl my hair and then i'll show you guys the finished result but yeah it just makes me feel a lot more like me because I feel like curls are like my signature. So yeah. But I'll put all the links to Foxy Locks in the description box down below. Um, you can use my codes Amy Rose Fox and you'll get 12% off everything. And then for more discount off the tapes, if you use the code Amy Rose Tape 15, you'll get 15% of the tapes. But, but like I said, I'll pop everything in the description box down below. go outside the snow is falling down and every child is having so much fun the snowman is twice the size as me with a smile as quirky as mine we're holding hands to keep each other warm while we stand and watch a choir perform and all the christmas songs that we love get yeah, all the christmas songs that we love okay my hair is cold um, as you can see, I'm sorry, I got a call and then I forgot to show you guys me doing like the top bit. But each side I do away from my face. Um, and then before I brush it out, I put in more oil again. A little goes a long way, but because I've got long extensions in as well, I probably just do like this much. But I've had that for the longest time. Um, and at this point, I'll kind of just dab it in like that. And then... There's two ways that I brush the curls out. So I either use the comb, the Foxy Looks comb, or the paddle brush. It kind of depends. I'm gonna do one on each side just so you can see the results of each. So I'll take out these little clips. So this side I'll do the paddle brush and I just gently start from the bottom and go to the top. And you can see it kind of makes the curls a little bit more like wavy. Um, and then this side, I'll use the comb. I mean, it's similar, but it kind of goes a little bit like, I mean, it's very similar, but I feel like when I use the comb, um, this is good just to kind of keep the curls a little bit more like tighter, but I prefer the looser look. So I'm gonna use the paddle brush. But yeah, this is my signature curls. Um, if you're interested in any of these products, then make sure you check out Foxy Lock. Like I said, my code and everything will be in the description box down below, as well as all the products that I use. So thank you to them for partly sponsoring today's video. I'm excited to get these um, refitted um, for when we have our twins.
friends, <laughs> which is so exciting. Um, but yeah, I really love how my hair looks. I've also got a reel, um, which would have gone live actually, of me like washing my hair, showing you guys the shampoo and conditioner, like the whole process of from start to finish. And yeah, if you want to know that in depth, then take then check out my Instagram. But yeah, this is my signature curls. But I'm gonna get ready now and we're gonna go for the meeting and then come back and then I'll have a chilled kind of like late afternoon evening with you. Okay, so I've just got ready. It is cold today. I don't know where my coats are, the long sleeve ones. I've got my gilets. Um, but I've just popped on this cozy scarf from H&M and then as you can see my hair is nice and curly and I completely forgot to show you my favourite part which is obviously the finishing result and it's the shine spray hair perfume. I don't put this to the roots but definitely in the ends and then you can brush it. Oh it's just so nice and I feel like it also helps with like knots and stuff like that. It's just amazing. So yeah, as you can see, my hair is all done. Um, I am going to go to a meeting now, like I said, and then come back and we can have a cosy afternoon slash evening. The weather today is just so cold. And I feel like, do you know, sometimes throughout the day, like the clouds will come like in and out and it will get a little bit sunny at points and like a bit brighter. It's been the exact same. It feels like it could be 3 p.m. <laughs> and it has been since we woke up this morning. I don't know why. It's just a gloomy day. So yeah, but anyway, time to go. Good morning, everyone. So it is now the next day. I realized the other day when I had my meeting, <laughs> I basically came home and I slept and I was so tired. And because we've had no heating or hot water, it's just been like extra hard to kind of function because do you know when you're like so cold that everything is just a struggle. It's like everything feels really stiff. So that's literally been what's going on. Luckily, like four, five days later, we've, finally got heating and hot water and i'm oh, i've never been so grateful for it in my whole entire life the guy has literally just left now and it's so nice because everything's getting toasty again and oh my god i've just oh, i'm so happy and i've just gone over like the fringe bit of my hair but i'm just gonna pop oil in my hair today because um i can't be bothered to redo it and i kind of like the curls when they're a couple of days old um i kind of prefer them because it's a little bit more effortless so I like them. I feel really excited as well because I'm filming my What's My Hospital Bag video today and it just feels so weird and surreal and I just can't believe it. And this weekend I'm just gonna try and like pre-film as many videos and it's just crazy that it's literally so soon that <laughs> we're having the babies and I just, I can't wait to just bring you guys along this journey and just, it's so exciting. Anyway enough rambling i feel like i filmed so much here at the minute and i'm really sorry if it's boring but this is kind of my space where i just have me time it relaxes me it's calming and i just love it so as you can see here there's a lot of parcels from amazon um and i thought we could unbox them okay please ignore all the clothes and stuff here i need to sort through that with you guys because Bradley took it all down from the loft. And I'm hoping that I've got some like jumpers and stuff in there that I can wear postpartum because I'm really nervous. And I've said this before, I'm really nervous to kind of dress myself postpartum that doesn't make me like not feel like me. I kind of just want to feel like me, but feel comfortable at the same time. And I know that I've got some jumpers and stuff in those bags. <laughs> so I'm hoping that we can find something. And then I kind of want to, not clear out my wardrobe but put things away that don't fit me or i'm not gonna wear and then i can kind of swap it for things that are just more realistic so yeah i want to do that as well today just because i feel like now is the time to do it because if i just keep waiting then when the babies are here i'm just not gonna care and i just want to help my future self basically okay some things that i did buy um, are some ribbons. I'm obsessed with this like brown colour at the minute. I don't know what it is. I really love it. Um, and I feel like it's just so rich and just stunning. So I bought this ribbon. And not only am I going to use it to wrap presents up with that I haven't really bought yet. <laughs> I bought some but like, oh, I don't know. It's just having a 
having babies in December, your mind that there's just so much to like think about and do and it's just hard to kind of focus on it. Whereas usually I put in so much effort and stuff with presents and wrapping and it's normally my favorite thing, but my mind just hasn't been there recently. I did want to get some ribbon um, and I basically want to put this around the house like on our garland and maybe some on the tree and things like that because i've seen other people do it and it looks so lovely so i really want to try it next up i've bought some makeup brushes now the reason that i bought these is because i tried to wash my brushes the lazy way and i put them in the wash machine in like a bag and let's just say i'm never going to do that hack again it's not even a hack it's the biggest fail and it's ruined every single makeup brush so yeah do you know like you've had makeup brushes for so long that you love and you're like you can just rely on and you will never chuck yeah i'm basically starting from scratch so i bought this set which i love and i have bought before in black i think um, I'll pop a link to them down below. Obviously, they're from Amazon. And I think it's a 25 makeup brush set. But you get so many different brushes in here, which are just such essentials. Um, and I couldn't recommend enough. So, yeah, this set is amazing. But yeah, don't do what I did and put all your makeup brushes in the wash machine. Because they would just get completely ruined. And I saw this hack ages ago. And I was like, yeah, it's going to work. Mm -mm. Maybe beauty blenders might work. But no, not brushes. Okay, this next thing is actually a present for the twins for Christmas. <laughs> it's so weird buying presents for like your own children. It just hasn't sunk in yet. <laughs> it's just the weirdest thing. Um, so I've seen this all online. I will open it because I want to show you. It's a projector lamp. Um, I think you put batteries in it or you can charge it. And basically, oh, it's not gonna work until I put batteries in it. I have got batteries in the twins room. Basically, there's loads of different shapes. There's like moon and stars, and then this one. I think you just take it off and then put this one on top when you wanna swap it. Um, and it's just really relaxing, and it's like a nice sensory thing for them. Um, I've seen loads of people do it when they like give their babies a bath and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm excited for like all things like this. Obviously, when they're like proper newborn, they don't care about stuff like that. But babies grow up really quickly, so things like that excite me. Okay, this next thing I have is for my hospital bag video, which of course I'll link this down below. This is like a card and you can get it in A5 or A4. I just got the A5 one because I thought it's a bit easier just to kind of have. Um, and it's a checklist and I really, really love it. Not only do I love the aesthetic, but I think it's really nice just to kind of know I've got everything and like physically tick it off. I just, yeah, I think it's amazing. And then anything else I can kind of add on the back. Um, but it's a really good quality card. This is a really good present to get someone. If I was doing like a hamper or something for someone, I'd so put this in. But yeah, it's just really cute. So the stuff for the mum, baby, and then dad, and then any notes. Bradley still hasn't packed his bag, which I'm not gonna lie, is stressing me out <laughs> a lot. For so long I was like, yeah, it's like, it is what it is. That's just what he's gonna do. But now I'm like, okay, these can come any day. Why are you not packing your bag? And he's like, yeah, I'll do it soon. I know I need to do it, but <sighs> honestly, it's driving me mad. Oh, okay, and then in here, um, I got these bows, white ones, to match the tree and stuff. Okay, I thought they had clips, they don't. I suppose you could put like bobby pins in them. Um, but these are for the tree and I thought it would look so nice because I feel like bows are really in this year and I love it because I love bows. Um, so I kind of want to put these on the tree because I think it would look really lovely. So um, I've got a packet of these which is very cute. So yeah, that was everything I've got recently from Amazon. Um, and then I also got sent this PR package from Neon. How cute is this? And in here is a calming hand balm and a candle, which is really cute. I think this must be part of their like Christmas range. This is so cute. So this is what you get in the little set. I love anything neon, like their candles and stuff. I have them everywhere in our house. Ooh, Tony's chocolate, but it's actually called Tony's Chocoloni. <laughs> um, this is what are you milk chocolate of caramel pieces and sea salt oh my god that sounds amazing how cool they've literally got their own packaging how cool they've literally got their own packaging oh i can't say no to chocolate oh my god stop it this excites me 
Neom Christmas Wish scented candle. Mandarin, cinnamon, and tonka bean. Okay. <laughs> this is so exciting. Oh my god. Guys, I'm obsessed. Oh my god, this is so strong and so amazing. It's called Christmas Wish. This looks and smells insane. Where should we put it? Do we put it in here? Do we put it in the front room? Maybe in the front room. Okay, I've put it up here for now. Yeah, those are some bits and pieces that I got from Amazon and also really kind of gifted from Neom. So what I'm gonna do now is put everything away. Um, I really wanna decorate the tree because I just think it will look really lovely. And I'm gonna make some lunch because my stomach is rumbling. My mum is also staying tonight, so I wanna make this bed all cozy and comfy for her get her pajamas ready, get everything all ready for her. Um, so yeah, we can do that as well. So yeah, anyway, let's clean up, which is the worst part. dressing table um i've just set up the little neon candle the calming hand balm and i've also had this for so long and it is a it's the scent de-stress and it is so relaxing just to spray um so yeah this is what the dressing table looks like and then these are my new brushes i'm so happy with them i need to push these on sound a bit but oh it honestly looks so much better um, and now I can actually do my makeup properly <laughs> and use brushes that actually work because yeah just don't put your brushes in your washing machine I just tried to find an easy way it's not worth it <laughs> it is not worth it Okay, I've got a Christmas film on in here. <laughs> Ignore the ice effects, but I need to put that back into the car. But I've just added a couple of bows. So I've got the gorgeous brown ones, which I think are stunning. And then also, where are they? Like the white ones. Um, and I love it, I think it looks so nice. I really love the tree. I think the little bows, especially the brown ones, make such a difference. Um, and I want to add little bits around the house and maybe on the garlands and stuff like that. I think it's so cute. I love this little trend this year with the bows. Um, and I'm going to use the rest of them. I'm going to save them. But like smaller ones here, I'm going to put on presents and stuff and pop them under the tree so they all kind of like match. Which I think is cute. I think I might just buy plain white wrapping paper with brown with brown ribbon so yeah that i think that's going to be my vibe this year for the one present i bought <laughs> because yeah this is just a nightmare at the minute anyway i've just received a parcel in the post which i'm going to open now and in here is my christmas presents it's like my pregnancy presents to myself and also my twin presents to myself this is basically my pregnancy presents to myself christmas presents to myself and so about to give birth presents <laughs> to myself so yeah the reason why i got so much is because on black friday katie loxton actually had a deal and the deals were insane I'm, i this is gonna be annoying but like i'm going in and out of focus so i'm really sorry about that oh my god guys the weather today is so bad 
I can't actually deal. I'm about to film my pack my hospital bag with me, but the lighting is so bad that I'm a bit like, okay, when can I do this? But yeah, the reason I got so much is because Katie Loxton had amazing Black Friday deals. And I think I saved like a hundred and something pounds, which is insane. So I picked up quite a lot and I'm so excited about it. So the first thing, oh, I love it. The first thing I got was this bag. First of all, this color is insane. It's in the shade mink and I love it. And I just thought this is such a nice bag to just wear crossbody, easy kind of mum bag. I can just fit like my phone and my purse, like any like essential bits in here. It's not getting in the way um, and it's just a really nice size. So yeah, I picked up this crossbody bag. I got a free scarf. <laughs> which is lovely. I can't believe I got a free scarf. <laughs> I was doing my order and it was like, you can add a free scarf to your thing. I was like, okay. I love it. How me is this? It's the Katie looks in like original kind of like logo. Um, but I think it is so lovely and I think it will go really nicely. Oh my God. I really, I think I might take this hospital. Genuinely, this is amazing. But how nice does this go with that? <laughs> I'm obsessed. Oh my God, this is so soft. Okay, this is going in my hospital bag. Okay, they've sent a lot of bags. I mean, they're probably good to use for Christmas time. I got this for the babies. I don't know if you can see it. It says Donaldson Twins on it. Um, and I thought this would be cute around Christmas time and I can put all their presents in here. So yeah, this is very exciting. So this next bag here, so this is actually, I think it's the Hattie Bourne edit. And I saw her wearing it on Instagram and I was like, oh my God, this is so nice. And then I was on me and Aring for so long. And then obviously everything was in sale and I was like, do I just get it? Um, and it worked out so affordable. So yeah, I love this. Love the color. I'll pop links to everything down below, of course. And then I got my initials here. The hard thing is, I don't know when me and Brady are gonna get married <laughs> because obviously we've had the twins, because obviously we've got the twins on the way. I think our priority at the minute is just focusing on them. I feel like we're not the kind of couple that wants to get married really quickly. I think Bradley did initially, but then after a while, it's kind of like, okay, <laughs> there's more priorities and we want a really nice wedding anyway. And I think it'll be fun to like, kind of plan it together and stuff like that, like, and not rush it. Hopefully in the next few years, maybe, who knows? So I also wanted to pick up some new stationary bits for the new year to help me be organized. Obviously I'm self-employed and I'm still gonna be working when I have the babies. So I just want to be organized, have bits and bobs together. Um, so I picked up this pencil case, which was so affordable and I got my initials on here. Again, in the color mink because I'm obsessed with it. Okay, so this bag is gonna be my hospital bag and I am so obsessed with it. Again, the color is in mink because I love it so much. It's just such a calming color and I feel like it's really nice for like any season. I just love it. Um, I didn't get my initials here. I got it on the little tag here instead. You can pick between there or there. I just thought it's nice to have it on the tag. Um, but this is such a nice size bag. It is such high quality. It comes with a strap so you can obviously wear it over your shoulders and stuff. Honestly, I love it. I've got this already in like a light colour and I had my eye on the mink one and I was like, no, I don't need it. But I feel like when you're buying yourself a gift and it was reduced so much in their sale, I was like, you know what? I deserve it. <laughs> this is my present for my pregnancy. Okay, here I picked up a new notebook, obviously <laughs> to match the pencil case. Um, and I just thought it is so cute, gonna be perfect for planning and I can just have everything kind of written down and yeah, I just think it's a really, really gorgeous planner. I don't know if I'm meant to put this bit in there. I don't know, I don't really wanna bend it. Um, and then lastly, I picked up a notepad refill for my notebook, it's actually upstairs. It's from Katie Loxton, obviously, because I've got a refill. Um, and it's kind of the one that opens both sides. I'll pop a link to that notebook down below as well. But yeah, I picked up a refill just because. I've nearly used up all the pages in that one, so I definitely needed a refill. Um, but yeah, I'm so excited. I feel like I can finally fully pack my hospital stuff. Everything's all organized, treated myself. It just feels all lovely. So yeah, I'll pop links to that down below. I also want to cut up my shortbread because I still haven't done that yet with you guys. But I'm not going to lie, me and Brady have eaten quite a lot of it. 
<laughs> so I need to cut up the rest and put it in the cake first. It's white outside And the night is cold Everyone's lighting candles in their homes Yes, it's Christmas Okay, my nose looks so red um, I've slicked my hair up into a bun and I put a mask in it just because you know sometimes when your hair's been down for so long you just kind of want it up and out your face and I'm gonna have a bath and I'm just gonna relax in a minute anyway because baths have literally I don't know what I would do without baths at this point in my pregnancy because it's just it helps me so much so I'm gonna run a bath um, I was meant to go through these but I think I might do it tomorrow so I'm not sure if I'll show you guys in this video or my next video but yeah I do need to do that that's why they're all out and Bradley's kindly put them there for me from the loft so I can kind of go through them and um, I've also made my mum's bed ready Bradley's gone to Gatwick to go and pick her up because um she's been away so I've made the bed for her so my rail is normally here but I've just moved it and put a stool there her bed is there and then I've got her dressing gown pajamas and cozy socks all ready for her so yeah her bed is ready and waiting and I'm sure she's exhausted and very excited to have a nice sleep in here tonight. But yeah, I'm gonna run a bath. I am absolutely exhausted as always because it's just that point in pregnancy. Um, so yeah, a nice bath is something that I definitely look forward to most days. So I'm in our ensuite with the worst possible lighting ever I need to put you on my tripod really but I don't know where it is <laughs> so I'm doing it from this way um I'm gonna use my favorite Elemis products just to take my makeup off so um I've got the Omega Rich Cleansing Oil I use this first when I have makeup on then I go then I go in with the balm and then I'll use the Pro Collagen it's like a glow exfoliant it's a magic time Feel it in the air that every child got their heart. Okay, I've done my skincare, it's a bit red at the minute, <laughs> but I'm gonna enjoy my bath and then badly at my mum's Yes, it's Christmas. Oh, 